Hi, this is Josh, pharmacist with Learned Blood Sugar Testing. We're going to discuss CVS Control Solution, uh, how to use it, as well as when to use it. First off, what is Control Solution? It's a liquid that we use to test the accuracy of the glucose meter. It contains a known amount of glucose, a known amount of sugar. It helps ensure that your meter is working correctly, and it can be useful for practicing technique as well. When is it recommended you use control solution? It's recommended you test when you first get your meter. If you suspect that your meter or test strips are not working properly, if you feel that your results are inaccurate, if you've dropped or damaged the meter, or for any other reason you feel like your meter uh, should be tested, that's a perfect time to use control solution. Okay, let's perform a control solution test. Now, obviously, to complete the test, you'll need the control solution, which uh, CVS will send to you for free. There is a number on the side of the box. That same phone number is also on the bottom of the meter. You call them, and about a week later, you'll get this in the mail. So you need the control solution, the meter, and test strips. Now, keep in mind, once you do start using the control solution, it's only good for 90 days. So you want to write a date 90 days from the first date that you use it, so you know when that control solution should be discarded. So here is our bottle of control solution. First off, we can insert a test strip. Again, always remember to keep the lid closed on that vial when you're not getting a test strip out. Insert that test strip just like you're performing a glucose test. And now that's prompting us for a drop of blood. So we can gently shake the control solution. And then they do recommend that you discard the first drop of control solution. Wipe the tip clean. And then the drop you're going to use, they recommend putting on a piece of clean plastic. Uh, the lid looks like it'll work for us, so we'll put a drop on that. And then we take our test strip and we just touch that to the control solution when it beeps we remove it and we wait for the reading okay so that is 133 that doesn't have anything to do with your blood sugar what does that number mean well first off you need to look and see which level I have level 2 and we look at our bottle and there are ranges on our bottle right there Level 2 normal should be from 113 to 172. Well, 133 is right in the middle, so that lets us know that our test strips and meter are working properly. They are right within the control strip range for level 2. And that's how you perform a control solution test. Uh, feel free to ask any questions in the comments below, and I would appreciate it if you'd like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.